This video includes a clinical example. It is not a substitute for the user manual. The BioByte Corrector System Requirements A steel wire with a minimum dimension of 17 by 25 inches is required in the upper and lower jaw. We recommend a 19 by 25 or 21 by 25 inch steel wire. A cinch back in the lower jaw is necessary. If self-ligating brackets are used, depending on the manufacturer, the brackets should be secured with wire ligatures to avoid breaking the flaps. The marked brackets should not be made of ceramic, because they often break. The components required for insertion. The BioByte corrector. A distinction is made between the left and right side. The spacers. They are required for adjusting the BioByte corrector. The screwdriver. It should definitely be secured with dental floss. For an easy insertion of the BioByte corrector, the screw connector should be placed in the correct position as shown in the picture. The following part is a clinical example of the insertion process. We start with the installation on the upper jaw of the left side. For easy insertion, bring the screw connector into the correct position. The screw connector is attached from the side. Then fasten the screw from the occlusal side with the screwdriver. The screw connector must not have any contact with the 6 bracket. In the lower jaw, the screw connector is also mounted sideways. It is screwed down from occlusal just like the upper jaw. The screw connector must not be in contact with the canine bracket. After the left side has been completely installed, the right side is started. Installation is as on the left. The screw connector is attached from the side. Then fasten the screw from the occlusal side with the screwdriver. The screw connector must not have any contact with the 6 bracket. In the lower jaw, the screw connector is also mounted sideways. It is screwed down from occlusal just like the upper jaw. The screw connector must not be in contact with the canine bracket. To check the bite, have the patient close the mouth. Make sure that the telescopes are completely closed. The lower jaw can be advanced gradually with spacers. They are crimped onto the thinnest telescopic element.
Fine adjustments are achieved by moving the screw connector on the arch. The insertion of the BioByte corrector is completed. Thank you very much for your attention. Further information about our products you will find under bbc-authortech.net